hapa ni kui hapa inaondoka Um, hii shida ambayo iliwafikisha leo hapa ni tatizo ambayo imetu affect leni kwa Kenya they are real minority and is recognized ya pili wamepoteza tool tuna tumepata ripoti ya kwamba he for scenes operation ianzwe and this area was declared as a disturbed area tumekuwa na relative calm na hata hayo the, the attack of that time was not really badentry kwa sababu hakuna mifugo inapelekwa ni watu kuja kufamia shule na kufamia kambi yetu na tunataka kusema it is something that must be investigated na kama kuna watu waliuzika uh, regardless who they are we don't have secret cows they must be brought to books we are all aware that the president has put a very clear roadmap and plan on police modernization where our police officers will be enabled to tackle and are uh, able to address the issue of attack from the criminals they will be able to have the helicopter i mean uh, we call the helicopters gunshot helicopters and uh, drones and all the kind of machineries the amrap nps so that they can able to be facilitated enough uh, to address the attacks from the the terrorist mimi siku kwa nini rais anataka kupeleka maafisa ya usalama haiti siku kwa nini na ilifikiwaje wakati unataka kupeleka walinda usalama haiti ili hali hapa bonde la inaitwa no drift hali ya usalama ni mbaya sasa tunapoongea kuna kijana ako amepikwa juzi KPR kuna mmoja ako mochari na tunaambiwa ati wa Kenya wanaweza enda tibiti usalama huko mimi siamini eh, unless bado ni wesi kueleswa kwa sababu gani na kama Kenya imeshindwa na usalama ya kutibiti wajambazi hapa nyumbani mtawawezaje kutibiti usalama huko nje hiyo ndio mimi kauli yangu ni kwamba kwanza Kenya itibiti wakora ya wajambazi wa wenye wako na silaha haramu ili usalama yetu kuwa salama wapeleke nje la sivyo mimi siamini mambo ya haiti eh, kwa kauli yangu vinapsi siamini haiti uh, kupeleka kwa, kwa askari yetu pengine tango jana kumekuwa na mashambulizi mapya baada ya uh, giza kutokea ah uh, mashambulizi ilitokea saa uh, shambulizi ni ile ya kutoka saa 3 mpaka saa kumi lakini moja mwingine uh, ikatokea saa 4 ya usiku uh, lakini mpaka saa hii atochasikia ambapo tunangoja maafisa ya usalama pengine tunatarajia uh, katibu mkuu wa usalama uh, wa wizara ya usalama na pengine wale kamati ya security ya county kiongozwa na county commission na sikia wameenda huko shule lakini ile jambo lilinishangaza ni kwamba what happened yesterday from yesterday they did not responded baka saa ya asubuhi uh, labda tu niseme pengine ni maafisa ya usalama walisema watafanya kazi lakini we wanted uh, security kuanzia kwa DC uh, wakuje pale chini ili kutulisa watu na kutueleza ni nini inaendelea
Hali ya usalama ikoje Hali ya usalama iko uh, si mzuri. Hali ya usalama si mzuri kwa sababu ya taruki. Kila mtu ajui atujui sasa hata ukitaka kusonga hivi, hata ukitaka saa kwenda hiyo njia, aujui hii wa chambasi kwa sababu walikuwa wengi. Penye tunaelezwa na wale wa KBR walianda waliangalia manyayo wanasema ni wengi. Na sasa mtu ukitaka kuingia msuli huko, pengine wako huko. So usalama yetu is not certain. Usalama ya waraya manini it is not certain. Hata kama ngombe haijachukuliwa haijafanywa wajajote, usalama si certain. Kama juzi hapa barabara ya mkutani waliua mtu mwenye anachunga gari. Sasa hata saa hii atuone kama ni ngombe wanataka. Wanataka kuua mtu. So hata kama utatembea peke yako usalama yako barabara kutoka Mojongoi kwenda hivi si mzuri. Kwenda kwenda mkutani si mzuri. Kutoka mkutani kwenda Marika si mzuri. So hiyo ndio vile usalama yetu hatuna uhakikisho kwamba mtu ukifika kesho ni Mungu tu. Hakuna operation ilifanyika. The operation has not paid any fruit. So far, uh, the criminals are daring the government. They are daring the security because now, kama operation ingefanyika, wangewasaje kushambulia kituo cha polisi hapa ke, ya jieshu. Kama operation ingekua inafanyika. Hapa tuko na askari ya kutosha. Lakini, operation uh, wajangili bado wanaendelea. Tuko na kambi ya jieshu, uh, RDU yu kashela, tuko na kapindasu, tuko na mugutani, tuko na jieshi tena hapa karau. Sasa ni nini inaendelea? So kumaanisha ya kuna ulekevu mahali. Ama kuna misinformation yenye inaenda kwa huko juu ama yenye inapelekwa kwa idara ya usalama. So kuna kuna ulekevu mahali. So either the system within Baringo is wrong or within operation is wrong. Or there is political interference. I believe kama hakuna political interference there is a problem. Hiyo mimi nasema kama mkachi wa semui. There is a problem kama ni siasa inaharibu mambo ya usalama. Nama ni nini inaenda tirisaling yenye tunaona hakuna usalama inaendelea. Nyewe imetulia juu kwa, ma, kwa chuma kadha. Lakini sasa tunaona inarejelea. Na tunaambiwa kwamba wamerudi, wamekucha kwa wingi, wanakuja kuamia simu hii. Sasa hiyo ni kusema ni. Eh. Mimi naomba hivi. Kwamba operation ianse. Aicha fanyo operation simu hii. Atuja fanyo operation. Sasa mpaka pandits wana, wana tufanyia operation. Na sisi tulika set ili operation ifanyike. Lakini sasa tumeka set operation ifanyike. Lakini patala ya operation ifanyike. Then pandits wame tufanyia operation kwa kaseti meni yetu. So nataka tupendue na tufanya haki ya kufanyia nini? Operation. Na hiyo operation haita ingiliana na shule. Naomba tusiseme shule inaendelea. Kutoka hapa mpaka, mpaka mkutane area yangu. is over 48 kilometers. So hii ingine operation ifanyike huko ndani. Ituondoe hii wakaiti. Mkaiti ni mkaiti. Sio mkenya. Ni mkaiti. Na tumeambiwa mambo ni ngavi? Ni tatu. So ya mwe. Na nasikia kwamba kuna helikopter. Kuna chopa ambaye natembea hapa. Na ilikuwa meshuka hivi, hivi majusi. Na ikawacha mambu yake. Inashuka katikati ya pandits. Na hiyo chopa huwa inashukanga. Ni kawaida yake. Na tumesema, tumiambia serikali kwamba puata mwenye chopa, na mupuate mwenye chopa, na tuakikishe kwamba na ya mekucha kuandika statement, na hii chopa ambaye na shuka maali kasete. Maali kasete ya serikali. Na ni chopa ya kipinapsi. Na siyo chopa ya sikari ya Kenya, siyo ya KDF, siyo ya police, na ni kasete region, na inashuka, na tunawakilia. Siyo ni kusema, wanatawala. So tunataka serikali mushike mwenye chopa. Tuliona chopa white na kuna chopa blue. Na inachulikana. So tunatarajia kwanzia kesho iwe meshikwa. Kama hicha shikwa tutasema yula hako kwa ndani ya serikali mkubwa plani. Ndiya nakulia basi. So tunangaishu wana mutu ambayo hiko kwa serikali. Na kama serikali awajui shikeni. Na musubo shika iyo ni kusema kuna mutu anafaitika kwa mambo ya chopa ya kulete resazi na mabunduki. Iyo ndiyo tunasema wasi. Kwa nini wa Kenya wangaike? Kwa nini watu wangu wangaike? Na tumesema kuna chopa. We are Baringo. And it is unfortunate because we have decided to work as, together, as, as, a, as leaders of Baringo. I was one of them. As a county leader, I feel so bad. Because sometimes the leadership within Baringo is not genuine enough to sort out this problem. 
I am reporting to you, uh, Chairman, that when you are doing your report in the Committee of Security, please indicate that we are still having leaders who are not ready to sort out this matter of banditry. It has become a problem. Just like Honorable Cameroon are saying, there is a chopper that comes all the time, and I suspect, and we all suspect, is one. F it is a chopper that belongs to one of us in the assembly. You are a member of the committee of insecurity, of security. Please, can we interrogate this matter and be put in the answer that we are enjoying while people are being pushed? and being displaced courtesy of us who are able or who are leaders in the assembly. Uh, kwa ile maneno ya Haiti, ya kwamba Kenya wametuma polisi huko, waende wapeane wa, wa, wa wa support. Ile hali sisi tunahumia hapa. Nafikiri ni common sense kwa serikali yetu ya kwamba kabla atujaenda kusaidia wengine hinche wenye wanahitaji msaada. Kwanza sisi tusaidie hapa nyumbani tuhakishe kwamba hii shida ya, ya, ya banditry imeisha ndio sasa tupeane msaada pale hinje kwa sababu sasa tunashangaa na mtu anajiuliza maswali kwani wale watu wa Haiti ni muhimu kuliko sisi hapa wa Kenya wenye tunauliwa kila siku ni muhimu kweli na tunatumia resources yetu tunatumia taxes ya wananchi enyao wananchi wenye wanauliwa hapa wana, wanaenda kusaidia huko huko Haiti Iyo resources, iyo, iyo, iyo pesa, ikuja saidia hawa, hawa watu wetu hapa, wa, wa polisi wakue equipped, na watuwe ishida, ndio tupeane msaada huko inji. Tumeambio ya kwamba kuna ndeke, helicopter, imeshuka mahali hapa on Thursday. Three days later, kuna famisi hapa. Na iyo ndeke na skin blue, ameenda mpaka kashuka huko Silale Kufika hapo ikakutana na ngine helicopter nyingine white So kwa tika hapa inaitwa nani nini hapa is it Naitwa nini Nalamoru Eh Lara Lana Moru ndeka kashuka hapo si ni kweli Kala yake ni nini blue Bahada ya muda kidogo ika shuka silale. Ndege ingine white ika join. Bwana commissioner. And I'm happy our NIS man is here. I want to demand from here today. We cannot be in a country where we are able to discover all these issues and we are not able to reveal who these people are. I am calling for Zara investigations. We want to know in Dege Blue, Nain Dege White, Nyanani.